Hey my friends Jean-Serge Gagnon here so today we're going to talk about a bot automation and a, 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 a piece of software that I just got that I haven't even used yet but I'm excited about what I've seen what I've seen the demos the explanation of what it does and what I've looked at so far and I want to show you live right now Conversio bot it's not and, and it's a it's a bot similar to if you've ever used mini chat on Facebook well it's very similar to that except it lets you build it on your own website you're not tied to like Facebook's you know um uh, uh policies or anything like that you don't you're not chance like for me I I set up Facebook bots multiple times and I lost my pages because of well I don't know whatever right uh, I did a few things that are wrong I'm, I'm a marketer so yeah sure I'm gonna push the envelope I'm gonna do things but then Facebook decides I'm not doing the right thing so they shut me out and I lose all the subscribers and there's ways of course with many chat to add them to your list and things like that but um it's still very frustrating with this it's just on your blog so I'm actually going to show you live right now well not live if you're watching the replay obviously but if you're also listening to the audio you really want to go watch the video I'm going to put the links there's it's an affiliate program for sure but just like anything else I do I always look for things that are affiliate programs and you should be looking for that too right you can get in but in any case it's super insane it was like 10, like I was paying 10 bucks a month right for mini chat for one page on Facebook and that's been I've been paying that for a couple of years now but this is a one-time thing you just pay a one-time amount right now it's like 30 40 to 50 dollars I don't know it depends on when you see this but the thing is that there's a one-time thing and like I said there's a link below but anyways let's get into it I'm going to show you Conversio bot I'm going to set it up myself I'm going to put it on my blog I'm going to create a bot a basic one to get people to subscribe or get them to maybe get my ebook I don't even know yet right? this is so cool I'm so excited I love doing this kind of stuff so hopefully you're going to enjoy this we're going to get into that in just a second but first this so the real question is this what are the strategies techniques and tools that you need to learn to generate residual income from the e-learning boom that's happening right now my name is Jean-Serge Gagnon and welcome to Course Income Secrets. All right, so Conversio Bot, what is it? If you've ever used ManyChat, you know that ManyChat lets you create these conversation streams and you can send broadcasts, you can do uh, things like that where you send it to people that are on your list or your Facebook list, right? The people that subscribe to your Facebook list and it's all tied to Facebook and there's all these uh, so somebody can't be on that list unless they have a Facebook account so and if you want to add them to your email list you got to do this man well not magic but manual stuff this conversion bot is an automated bot that lets you do it on your blog so we're going to show you right now what it looks like um and let me just share my screen here let me just go over, over here and let's just go here like I said like I said I actually haven't well, let's get that out of there that's not part of this so the like I said uh I haven't actually used it let me just make this a little bit smaller let's just reduce the size of this because it's I'm zoomed in here so conversio bot conversio bot so this is basically the the view like I said I have I haven't even used it yet I just clicked on the link to log in I just bought it just now and I don't know maybe I'm going to show you and it's going to be totally no good but I'm hoping it's not and it certainly looked pretty cool there was a demo there was a video they they gave me an example of a bot how it would be built so I'm just going to go in here I'm just going to go and create it and see how it goes if I have a lot of trouble then you know obviously somebody with technical uh, like I'm a kind of a geek so I I don't have too much trouble but still it should be relatively easy right so first of all if I look at this I can see I have an account it's got an unlimited lifetime deal which is really awesome like I said that's the current thing right now it's not monthly uh they have other uh, uh you know obviously upgrades and things like that so I'm just going to go here I'm going to say create a bot let me just show that to you on the screen here uh, down the bottom there whoops let's move my down the oh come on there so down the bottom here you'll see if I scroll down right you'll see there's a create a bot right there so I'm just going to click on that I don't even like I said I don't even know what's going to happen so it's giving me a name all right so bot name so let's give them a name let's say it's uh what do I want to do so but uh so I'm going to do my simple 
online uh, strategies list okay so I'm going to create a bot that's going to ask people who they want my free 10 simple online strategies ebook and they want to be added to my list right so let's do that and go and create that and then I have the steps here you can see the steps it says simple online add a block okay so let's see what happens so builder design settings publish it says right there right so it's as you can see right here there's four steps so builder design settings and publish right so first I'm going to say add block let's add a block new block I don't know oops let's move that a bit for you to see oops wrong 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 mouse so there's a new block I'm just going to click on that see what happens so bot message okay so this is a bot message welcome new block one this is a block default welcome this is a block default message uh two seconds user response placeholders okay so I'm going to say I'm just going to say welcome to my blog okay this is going to be for my blog I'm going to save that like this now I have one block here oh let's call it let's give it a name let's call it welcome okay save I'm sure I can do all sorts of cool things but I'm just going to do this I'm going to add another block oh new block too okay so that's right at the same place this one is going to say um question about online okay here we go so I'm going to say uh I are you looking to grow your business online okay so I'm going to ask them a question I'm going to say are, is that you know are you here to do that right I'm going to say save and then I'm going to add another block I'm going to say if they say yes where is it new block three is right there let's put the welcome right here that way new blocks are showing up okay so this one here I'm going to say yes online building and then I'm going to say over here I'm going to say awesome thanks for your in interest interest in my blog would you like my free ebook on the top 10 simple online strategies to attract customers to you okay I'm going to say save that uh, now this is going to be a question about I don't know is there a way to connect these do I do this no there must be a way to can what is this C is I'm trying to understand these different things this probably deletes it and then I can connect this to here oh there you go connect that here oops okay so that's connected whoops what's going oh I must have I copied it oh that's what the C does the C does a copy so I'm just going to delete this one then do you want to delete this block yes so delete the block okay so now I have this one which as you can see has a line to it which which I assume means that after this one if I do this one there's a it says bot message then there's two seconds over here and then there's text you can save different things user response user response input type text buttons cards multiple choice okay let's just do that okay so I'm just going to do that I'm going to leave that like that okay so now I have my question about uh and yes if they say yes actually this one here probably needs a user response no input uh, text buttons let's say buttons I won't allow user to skip this button type option let's say yes and then let's say no no just just browsing yes absolutely you 
weekly okay so now I have these options and what do these do if I click on this external link no that's not what I want let's get that out of there okay let's just say that continue I'm going to save that now what does that do oh well, now there's two of them okay cool so this is the yes the first option goes here perfect yes now I can move it down here let's move that link okay so then I want to create another one add another block this is going to be called no no two simple strategies okay oh I forgot I should have I need to put some text in here I want to say this is actually really really cool now I'm gonna it's gonna be cool to see how it interacts on the blog on the website so we're gonna do that but uh okay so now I'm gonna say okay no worries no worries what about my 12 critical steps to your to your online success does that sound like something you'd want to get for free there we go user response I'm going to add another one here it's going to be a buttons it's going to be and then I'm going to add another one it's going to see nah. okay so now I'm going to say that continue and save it okay so note a simple strategy I'm going to say um, that's actually not my free ebook on the top okay so that's not it that's not the one so this one here is would you like uh your ebook I'm gonna add here user response this one has a yes or no buttons interesting okay add another one I'm going to make this okay now we're going to have this continue okay so this is the one that I want here <coughs> so yes online building no simple strategies okay so this is the no this is the one here so question about marketing and then I'm going to add another block here that's going to say it's going to be the no here it's going to be now this is going to be no no online building and then this one is going to be <clears throat> so I'm going to just add a user response it's just going to be text uh, type custom text so I'm just going to put custom text test case new custom fields should not be specified so I have any options test case nothing custom field uh, uh, question whoops I'm going to make this a question so if they have a question allow user to skip this there we go continue save <coughs> so now we have the no to online banking goes over here and then they have this and then this is no to simple online strategy uh, this is actually going to ask them another question it's going to say would you like my free ebook okay so that's the one here so no to simple strategies and then let's add a block it'll be yes yes simple strategies okay I'm going to add user input oops I oh okay this is going to be text uh, an email address validation uh, test case that's fine and uh, email address 
that's so well no let's not do that okay um perfect okay now I'm gonna do this user response save and then I guess I have to have I probably have okay so this will be here I'm going to make this yes over here and then no over here uh, and then uh, they have a question no to simple strategies yes simple strategies this will be sending it out to them <coughs> so I'm not gonna uh, we're, uh, we're already 15 minutes in I'm not gonna I'm gonna say a preview I'm gonna oh, I should preview it design okay next next so design okay so that's kind of cool you can change the way it looks so the background the message bubbles wow this is really cool the body message the colors very cool okay so have a nice day welcome design okay that's good I'm gonna save that I'm gonna go next all right do I have okay the next part is the settings so simple online strategies list but name simple online sim okay let's just say js's <clears throat> and then there's more stuff custom domain features things like that that's I don't know but I probably will end up maybe I'll upgrade I'm not sure but we'll see so auto close chatbot what is that I'm not sure automatically close the chat bot at the end of the chat no I don't want to do that I want them to close it extreme delayed bot what is that automatically open your chat bot when your visitor lands on the page auto open on your time only so these are okay so these are extra so you've got to upgrade okay so these are upgrade extreme features right that's pretty cool sound settings include alert sound on chatbot messages let me turn that on sound on bot load on initial message I want sound on everything I want to annoy them instant notifications receive email notifications when a visitor reaches set goals oh cool okay email subject new interaction with simple list notification email select goal select all but just for the fun of it see how it works marketing automation block capturing email select yes simple strategies marketing automation service aha so this is where I would set up uh, click here to configure a new marketing automation service okay so I probably have to add a Weber connect a Weber down here my name and email allow access now it's connected perfect all right so now I've got my connection done for Aweber and then I want to go in here select a service uh, I guess I have to reload maybe save this and I'm gonna oh by the way yeah you can see up top there's there's these options save launch and next and all of this right so I'm just gonna re select service yes I'm gonna reload this page I'm gonna go back to the design and I'm gonna go next see if that loads it I probably I'm not sure if that's one of the things but maybe that's how it works if I go down here go back down here to this yes and then I want oh yes there you go a Weber and select my list is going to be my 10 simple online strategies my simple online strategies oh, there they there it is right here all right so now I have do I have to click on this no that's probably the yeah okay goal setting welcome set your goals it says choose which blocks you would like your visitors to reach oh okay so yes to online building yes I want them to reach that Google and oh that's cool so I can act, actually add these things my pixel ID uh, all that stuff that's great my brand name hmm brand name I don't know this is going to be 
Jean Serge Gagnon. And my brand link https com. What status? Brand status. Sure, why not? So save. All right, so now it's saved down here. Now I go to next. What's next? The publish. So I best that probably be where I would launch it. Full page bot link, extreme features of full page bot. Okay. Widget bot code. Okay, so this is the code so please copy the above snippet and code and paste it to your html code before closing the head tag so that means I go to my blog and I go and edit the blog and I want to go here to my wordpress my dashboard and I'm going to go into my plugins my settings insert headers and footers and I'm going to add this to my footer well first of all okay let's just actually I should have visit site I want to see so you as you can see on my blog right now you just see my right my blog right you see my blog here and if we look down the bottom if we look down the bottom you can see that there's uh, there's nothing down there that uh, there's no bot no nothing right I'm going to see if this just works so I'm going to add this here to the head paste that in here now I've got my my bot over here and I'm going to save that well actually let's show you again so in my my in my wordpress blog I have a plugin called um it's called headers and footers it's a plugin and then then I can go headers and footers and I can add that I already have my uh pixel actually you know what I got my Facebook pixel in here and everything else let's get those let's get those IDs in here this is Google Analytics I got my Google Analytics too let's do that let's put those into the conversion bot I'm going to launch it first because if it's not launched it probably doesn't work and wordpress plugin oh they even have a specific wordpress plugin for it but anyways okay uh then I go back to my settings here I'm going to go into here and add these uh Facebook pixels and stuff where was that Facebook pixel no this is the Google Analytics this is my UA number my ads conversion I don't think I have that one in there so let's just uh get the pixel code the pixel code is right here my pixel id and I'm going to save that okay so now I have a pixel id and well I already have that on my blog anyway so it'll just be showing up more than once but anyways so now in my blog I added this to it I'm going to save it and then let's reload my blog to see how it looks if I reload this blog uh that's not there eh? there you go look at that except this I have my little look at that it's even a little logo that oh you can't see it hold on let me show you where it, what it looks like it's down the bottom here down the bottom of my blog it's got this little pop-up that came up over here and it's down there it's there it's there I can just click on this and then it'll pop up the bot this is so cool look at that this is so cool the bot is there welcome to my blog are you looking to grow your business online yes absolutely yes awesome yes absolutely okay awesome thanks for your interest in my blog would you like to free ebook to the yes nice sounds very interesting look at that that's so that is so cool it took me just a few minutes to set up and now it's going to ask for my email I'm going to say bot test at fxos.com uh, but uh, let's let's call it uh conversio conversio because that's what it is and I'm going to send that I'm going to say enter and there we go so now it's going to I don't know if that'll work let's see if that works because that's supposed to have sent it doesn't say anything else because I didn't do anything else at the end of the thing I probably should go back to the bot here and add for example if I go back to this you can see this let's move me, me down the bottom again so over here if I go back to the builder um, I really want to have a yes simple strategies and I want to say uh, add a block 
simple whoops simple simple scent fantastic fantastic check your inbox at and then let's see over here it's going to be there must be a way to add a placeholder no is that what that is oh yes email address perfect so at, there you go check your email so save all right so now it's saved and I'm going to launch the change so oh you missed that right when I saved it when I saved it it uh, popped a message so uh, oh actually that's not right so let's move it down here mm, connect these two there we go there must be is there a way to zoom that out or something mm. might want to have a yes no no to online building yes simple strategies uh, yes yes you can't really see what I'm doing either right let's move that over here I'm just moving these around let's cancel that I just want to move this around yes to simple and then simple scent is good there we go so now no to simple strategies what about the other one so I'm going to say add a block and I'm going to say this is going to be over here it's going to be uh, yes to 12 steps and then let's wait wait what email should should I send send it to okay use your input there's going to be an email address uh, input text is going to be email address and then validation yes customize close and okay so did I not rename that hmm. nice did I, I oh I pressed close instead of save that's smart yes to 12 step I'm going to say fantastic what email do I send it to and then I'm going to user response go go back here text email address and continue and save okay so now this one is yes to so yes and then over here I want to say uh, actually if they say no I just want to say what does this one say does it say do you have a question okay let's just make the no go to this guy there we go so they both go here right yes to the 12 step and then I need another block that says awesome you're okay this one here is going to say 12 step stent right and then this is going to be great oops great check your email at and the placeholder is going to be the email address and then move that there like this save and there we go so 12 steps sent there we go so that's that's the bot that I've got let's just save it and launch it just going to launch the change and it says launch successfully again I missed I missed that I should have shown you what it did so when I make a change here let's say I change something online building type it below and save it and then when I when it shows it shows up here that it's the, the change updated I have to click the launch button right here which will launch it and now it's launched all right so now 
uh this is just going to ask a question I don't know if there's anything I can do oh I guess I can oh okay I can click on the little red thing to add the next step automatically without having to uh oh no that's not right I'm editing the thing if I close this can I okay if I'm drag it no it doesn't do anything it has to go to something so there's the c for copy there's the x to delete and uh that's uh so that's it so now I'm going to preview I'm going to launch it I think it's already launched no okay might have changed a little bit now I go next and let's go back to the settings because I have to add the second email list right so I have the other one here I want to add a new list this is going to be the block where there's yes to 12 steps and I'm going to say Aweber again and over here it's going to be the 12 steps is down the bottom 12 step to your online success and I'm going to say save and I'm going to launch it again right so yes to 12 step I want them to get here save it all right so now um there's also a yeah okay so that's basically that's you know like if I go back to this here and it's there right let's move that over here for you show you what the bot looks like on the side there's the bot okay so there's the bot and I'm going to say six minutes ago and then I there's no there's no place for me oh no hello there's no place I guess it I would have to have a place for them to check my email let's go check my email let's go see if I go to my email over here oh very cool okay so I'm going to show you this this email thing here uh share the okay let's just put that into the other page okay so if I go back to here now this these are the emails I got from the bot when I first uh this these are like this one here I've connected my conversion to Aweber right and that's when I first connected it let's just move this over here right so I've connected my bot my conversion bot to Aweber that's the first thing that happens then I got this e this interaction uh login id desktop welcome there's no input the this is just a login id I guess they attribute that and then uh, then I then it shows me what happened oh that's very cool so these are notifications just showing the stuff I just put in yes online oh nice sounds interesting block name yes conversion at fx that's the email I sent so the next one is showing me uh that the, the email got added in petty petty I guess I'm in New Brunswick eh? <laughs> all right and then it shows the email I got here's my 10 simple online strategies I got it got added it got sent this is super super awesome how easy it was to set up right wasn't it super awesome okay and then the, the because I have two lists at the same time and then I get the introduction as well so those are the emails I got because I subscribe now this is just something else okay so so yeah so that's all it took is just to set this up save this up and then I'm I'm done it's done it's there it's live on my blog on top of my you know already um if I just close it right here on top of my blog now I've got now can I can I start it over again let me see uh, let's go back here and move this for you so you can see so whenever I closed it this little fella came back right so and I'm going to click on it again see what happens oh it just loads up the the rest of the chat powered by Jean-Serge Gagnon it just loads up the chat and the, your history and this is very cool powered by which is my blog <laughs> that's very cool my own blog it's my own link for the basic account it's like insane I can't I can't imagine how awesome the rest of the how the rest of this the thing would be so anyways that's that's what the conversion bot is all about you got this design here you can have the builder here you can set up 
your you know in a few minutes just set this up in a few minutes this is super cool I'm very excited to have gotten this and I hope you enjoyed this and this was conversio bot demo first time demo me never using it before just going in there and creating it I mean sure I have some experience with mini chat and I could I was able to to show you exactly how to do it quickly because I've used mini chat before but that doesn't mean that you can't use it and if you have any questions let me know of course there's going to be links affiliate it's an affiliate program like anything else I joined there's going to be links down there where you can get your own copy of this for your own website all right we'll see you in the next episode this has been course income secrets the entrepreneur's blueprint to generating income from the e-learning boom. Some of your friends need to hear this message, so don't forget to share. For more content like this, go to CourseIncomeSecrets.com and make sure to subscribe and follow us here. My name is Jean-Serge Gagnon, until next time.